look at this. Can I really spread out on here? <laughs> you can really, spread really good out. spread. <laughs> yeah. I've long admired this gold sofa on the television. Oh, and look at you sitting on now it. Now I'm on it, dear. Yeah. 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 Oh, oh, wonderful. Can I look inside there? Oh, right, OK, what have we got? Well, what do you fancy, man? Do you like okay. a Midori? I've got Midori. Yeah, what else is there? Tequila rosé. OK, I think I'm going to go for the green drink. Mmm, yeah. Yeah, a look. nice Yoda drink. <laughs> <laughs> That's what it is, isn't yeah, it? It is disgusting, but I like <laughs> it. <laughs> it's like someone's melted down Shrek. <laughs> That's quite a goblet there, isn't Well, yeah, it? well, just listen, just sip it, don't get too... No, I won't. I'll <laughs> nurse it. Don't go too cray-cray. Look, I'm steamed up just I thinking. Know. I know. I'm excited. <laughs> now, until now, you've been best known for Game of Thrones. <laughs> I think someone's got some fans in the house. But we've got to talk about your new film. Not many people might have heard of it. It's this low-budget indie art house flick <laughs> called Star Wars The Force Awakens. <laughs> I've got to say this. I saw it the other day, and because it's gone back old school, isn't it? It's like the first three. I was transported back to being an eight-year-old. Uh -huh. And I was wearing a school uniform as well. <laughs> <laughs> It, it does, it does. Right from the beginning. It's like it's like you're watching it when you were a child again. Yeah. It's unashamedly yeah. old school and it's yeah. filmed like yeah. that. And really authentic and you, you've got that same feeling of excitement like it's Christmas. Yeah. And do you know what? They've gone easy on the old CGI. Yeah. They've it feels really like there's a bit of that. art to it. Yeah, yeah. I mean, normally I guess I, I get my guests to explain the film, but yeah. you can't because you don't want like spoilers do you know well it's difficult to... it's very difficult mm. to talk about the film because what i think is exciting is that disney and lucasfilm want to give us this experience like we're saying like we have when we were kids yeah yeah, yeah when yeah. you went to the cinema and you didn't know there weren't a million trailers you didn't know exactly what the story was about no. so you go and you get that surprise yes and we have so few surprises at least i do in my life oh dear, i know love oh that... <laughs> yes oh i know love that i think it's a really exciting thing for us to yeah. have at christmas I mean, you are basically involved in a lot of things where you have to keep secrets. Yeah. Are you good at secrets? Because I'm like a couple of Lambrinis and I sing like a canary. <laughs> I'm in there, I do. I can't keep a secret. I've heard you're like a leaky bucket. Yeah. <laughs> Throw that drink down your top. <laughs> <laughs> Leaky bucket, that's my Tinder name. But, <laughs> I like it though. I like, I'm like a vault. I'm used to keeping the secret. You're like a vault? I'm like a vault. Oh. <laughs> so you did have a few too many Lady Petrols. Yeah. Do you ever let anything go then? Does no. the vault maybe open? Does no. maybe the door sort of. A little bit. No, not at all. A little bit seeps out. No, it's it's glued <laughs> shut. It's glued shut. Okay. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I don't know what we're talking about anymore. <laughs> <laughs> well, I can say. Oh. <gasps> oh. <laughs> You can see that as well, yeah? You can. <laughs> you can. <laughs> Do you love him? What's in this Midori? Oh, my God. <laughs> For those who don't know, this is BB-8 from, uh, from the film, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, from the Star Wars film. <laughs> is he house-trained? He's not going to do anything, is he? No. Oh, don't you dare. No, no, get him. Get him out. <laughs> get him out of me. Get him, BB-8. Get, get, get him. Him. Don't try to buy me. Kill. Bloody thing, try to buy me. <laughs> <laughs> Get away, joke! <laughs> <laughs> oh, they stink. <laughs> Get away! Oh, no. No, he's sweet, give him a stroke. No, no, oh, no. I understood that. No, no. no. <laughs> Sorry, I don't speak facts. <laughs> um, <laughs> Did you play this total badass called Captain Phasma? Yes. 
And I love Captain Phasma. It sounds like he's like a, a 70s soul group or something. Yeah. Hi, I'm Captain Phasma. The yeah. <laughs> yeah, it feels good just to say, doesn't it? Yeah. The name, uh, JJ came up with the name because it was based on one of his favourite films, Phantasm, and there's a silver mirrored killer ball. <laughs> There's yeah. a killer ball oh. in Phantasm, <laughs> and uh, and that he can't parallel park very well, can he? <laughs> 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 well, let's take a look at a clip. This is a trailer for the incredible Star Wars: The Force Awakens. What was it like being on set <laughs> while all that was going on? Because it must have been crazy. It was totally surreal. Yeah. Also because I had probably the best problem in the entire world, which was that I was filming Game of Thrones at the same time as Star Wars was going to be filmed. So it took a bit of working out. So when I was told, you've got the part, yeah. then we had to work it out, and that took a couple of weeks. So I kind of had to come to terms with the fact that I might not be able to do Star Wars. But they were very generous and they all worked it out. And is everyone in costume while you're there? Yes! Oh, yes, that, oh. and walked onto the set, the most enormous set I've ever walked onto. Yeah, yeah. The most incredible detail. I walked onto <gasps> the set and was in it. Yeah, that must have been weird at the canteen, getting, like, a Wookiee hair in your volleyball. <laughs> 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 you know, like, eh, 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 what's this? Yeah, <laughs> lightsabers as tea stones. <laughs> yeah. yeah, oh, that's a good idea. Yeah, it's not bad, is it? BB-8, what was it like acting with all these humans? <laughs> Mm. Can't we get him up on the sofa? Hello. Can't he have a roll around on the sofa? Do you think so, really? Would you like that? <laughs> no. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> uh, this is your first big film. Um, how much acting had you done before Star Wars? Because I heard you were Henry the Hoover in Holby City. <laughs> <laughs> is that true? <laughs> no. <laughs> Where you got it? Oh, that oh, no, was it, Emily the Over? <laughs> You've oh, really upset him. I know. Um, you have. You've sent oh, him God. off. It's, it's, oh. Look at that look he's given me. Don't give me that look. <laughs> <laughs> he's really oh, shooting oh, you evil. This is gone. Yeah. When they said they were making uh, another Star Wars film, there must have been every lovey in theatre land ringing up, going, "Please give me a part." Yeah. Why did he choose you? Well, isn't it obvious? <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> You are fantastic in the part, but why darling, you? Oh, thank you? Darling, but call darling, me. Let's no, do lunch. Go to the art. <laughs> No, I had to beg. I spent about six months begging, 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 begging saying, yeah. please, can I be seen for this yeah. film? And I think JJ just did it out of sympathy because I'd worn him down. Yeah, oh, my goodness. <laughs> okay, you, 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 what, you were a big Star Wars fan. Yeah, before. I was. Yeah. Oh, I love Star Wars. I first saw it when I was about six years old, and I adored it. I really loved this group of misfits all thrown together. Yeah. And there was just something about those two robots in the desert that I loved. I think... Being about six, I thought, oh, robots in sand. A bit yeah, dangerous. Yeah, yeah. What did you think about robots in sand? Well, I mean, I just felt sorry because like, sometimes it's hard enough getting sand out your crocs, <laughs> let, alone, <laughs> let alone all your intricate bits and stuff yeah, like that. Yeah, your keyboard. And sometimes, you know what? I'm, I'm going to be deep for the first time in Chatty Man, but aren't we all robots in the desert? <gasps> <laughs> When you're, in, when you're in a film like Star Wars, you get asked to do all sorts. Now, I heard you do a fantastic impression of Chewbacca. Is that true? I've only done this one other time. <laughs> Can you do it for me? What's yours like? <laughs> 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 a bit more... No, please, that is cat go! <laughs> the trouble is, I sound like my dog when I'm trying to give her a worming tablet. <laughs> 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 Is it that? If people are just tuning in now, can you imagine? <laughs> yeah, Wookiees have got their own channel. <laughs> <laughs> yes, that's spot on. <laughs> like Springwatch. 